Hey there everybody, Phil here for AndroidCentral.com with the Nexus S running Gingerbread. This is the Android open source project code build that Chris Sawyer's put together, so all credit goes to him. Um, it's really just very basic stock gingerbread. So up top and down on the bottom, we can see a little different. Um, when you open up the menu button, you see your icons are different. Uh, home screen is still exactly the same. You still bounce between them the same way. Up top, you get your notification bar. It looks a little different, but down here you have manage apps now in the menu. So this is sort of new, sort of not, right? This is a list of all the apps on the phone, downloaded or otherwise. You can actually get this through the settings now in any Android phone. Uh, it's been brought to the forefront here in Gingerbread, which is good for this reason, for stop. So if you need to quit an app, you can just do it there. You don't need a task killer. You don't need some third-party app to do it. Gingerbread, Android actually just does it just fine. So uh, let's bounce around the settings for a minute while we're here. Go to About Phone just so we can see. Android 2.3.1, the point one's kind of been added for this build. So uh, again, very unofficial, uh, just really built off the straight code that was released today. Now watch here at the top and the bottom. When you bounce through lists now, you see you get a little flash when you hit the top or hit the bottom when you hit the extreme. So that's kind of cool. It's a neat little uh, UI tweak. But otherwise, everything in the settings is pretty much as is. Um, not that different from Froyo. Let's look in the launcher. Now, we don't have any Google Apps. You don't have any Gmail. You don't have the market. You don't have Google Maps. Nothing. This is just a straight code build, so don't expect to actually be using this. Uh, the camera, as you see here, also does not work. So this isn't going to be your daily driver yet. We're still waiting for the official update. Uh, music app hasn't changed. Let's look at the browser. So I already fired up Android Central once, and we'll reload it. And watch how quickly it renders. We are on Wi-Fi, so that helps. But the, uh, just rendering the page, the browser does really well. Nice and fast. I appreciate that. Thank you for doing a good job. Good job, Mr. Browser. Uh, let's see. Duck out of that. And not a whole lot else to say. Really just a lot of behind the scenes tweaks. We've loaded NeoCore and Quadrant. They don't really work. Uh, Linpack, on the other hand, does. And it's a little faster than the stock scores we got back uh, when we first had Froyo. What's in the high, like 38, 39. Now we're getting 42, 43, 44. So that's kind of cool. Another look at the home screens. Let's see if the dialer works. And it does not. So again, very basic code base. You're not going to be actually using this. In fact, I'm going to be getting rid of it as soon as we're done here. Uh, back at the launcher, anything else we want to look at? Uh, let's try the voice dialer. See, yeah, it looks like that works. Cool. Nice. Anything else? Um, the gallery is a little quicker, but it's still the standard gallery. Here's the uh, one thing I know you all want to see. Blink off. And back on. And blink off. Nice little UI tweak. I like that. It's very cool. And blink off. So there you go, guys. Quick look at Gingerbread. See you later.